Hi friends, it's me, Mary, with Let's Bake and Cook Stuff. I'm performing an experiment today. You know how I'm always telling you that baking and cooking are science? So I'm performing an experiment today that is it going to be, you know, the biscuit trend that's going around with the Bisquick, the butter, the sour cream, and the 7-Up? Well, a couple of years ago, there was a biscuit trend going around called Butter Swim Biscuits. I'm going to experiment, hence science, and I'm going to mix it all together and put it in the pan just like the butter swim biscuits. Let's see if it turns out. Experiment with me. Here we are on the science channel. I mean, let's bake and cook stuff. So check it out. I have one stick of melted butter. I'm just gonna pour it into this pan just like we did with this, the butter swim biscuits a few years ago. I've got my oven heating to 425 degrees. I've got four cups of Bisquick, one cup of sour cream. I know it's crazy, right? and one cup of 7-Up. It's actually Sprite. Mix it up. Okay, now for the experiment part, I am going to toss this whole blob of dough into this pan with the melted butter. This might not work out. Smush it in there to the bottom. Okay, now I'm gonna cut it into nine even biscuits. You could use a knife. I'm using this just because it goes straight across evenly for me and it's just easy. And uh, these are gonna have to be cut when you're done baking them anyway. This is just sort of like a marker. We're just marking it, marking our territory. <laughs> okay, here we go. In a 450 degree preheated oven for about 20 minutes. Let's see if this experiment worked. We don't know. We're gonna see. Butter swim. Seven up biscuits. I'm gonna cut them one more time. They were already marked kind of from before, so. Ooh, see that steam coming off of there? Mm, it's gonna be so good. Cheers. Mm. That's a great biscuit, just like that. You add some butter to this or some jelly or some honey or anything, just make it that much better. I say, give these a try, but I wouldn't waste time cutting them and I wouldn't waste the biscuit dough. Just we used all, every bit of it. They turned out perfect. Give this recipe a try. Let me know how you like it. Thanks for watching. You take care now.